What's the deal, you guys? This be your boy, Scatter by Nature TV, and we're here for a brand new episode of Yes for the Mess, where we talk about celebrity gossip, hot topics, and all things reality TV-based. Before we get into today's mess, let's talk about what we got coming up. Now, as you guys already know, the Whether You Like It or Not panel is coming to a close this Monday, and it will be on Simply Sakina's platform. You will see the main six, which is myself, Ya, Joe, T, Really B, and Sakina, but you will also get our rotating guests, uh, Reggie and LT27, as we close out Potomac. The Whether You Like It or Not panel will be going on hiatus up until Atlanta, but don't you worry because in, in the meantime, in between time, Terrence, myself, and Josiah will be back for the Roasted Review for SWV and Escape Show, The Queens of R&B. We will be back to review that, talk about it, roast about it, do all those things. Josiah will be having certain videos that will be dro dropping right before the show, so make sure y'all get ready for that, all right? All righty then. So... With that being said, let's get into it. Now, as you guys already know, we didn't already talked about Drew Sedora and Ralph um, Pittman already, and it was already revealed already that um, Ralph was the one who went and filed for divorce. But according to TMZ and the Neighborhood Talk, that's not so. So let's get into what we see right here. So this is the situation at hand. So if you see it, this is from the Neighborhood Talk, and I literally just seen this. It just came across my, my page, okay? And and it says that we now have a clearer picture of how nasty and petty this divorce is going to be. It turns out that Drew had already filed for divorce from Ralph, from Ralph an hour before him. TMZ obtained her divorce petition in a Gwinnett County court stamped it as received on February the 27th at 1 p.m. 1.10 p.m., I'm sorry. Meanwhile, Ralph's documents were stamped at 2.11 p.m. the same day. Interestingly enough, she lists their separation date as February the 23rd, while his says it was February the 19th. So it looks like they were both trying to rush to the damn courtroom. And it's just like, you know, it, it's like, okay. <laughs> Oh, shit. Okay, so Drew is really the one that was trying to get the hell up out of it. So now that we find out that she was the first one to really file because, you know, when the original story came out, it was said that, you know, it was him that filed for divorce. And a lot of us feel like, you know what I'm saying? Um, Drew, you should have been the one to file. You should have been the one. You, you should have been the one to file for divorce. Like, what are you doing? What are you talking about? You should have been the one. But now it looks like she really was the one that filed, but he tried to beat her ass to the punch. That's what it that's how it's coming across, child. He tried to beat her to the punch, but she beat him to the punch. But I want to know what really, you know, got this thing going. I really want to know this. Is it because you found out what he was really doing in Tampa because he wasn't in Mississippi with me? So what the hell was he doing up in Tampa is my question. So that's what I'm trying to figure out. But hopefully we get more going on with this story because there is a lot to cover with this. There's a lot to pick up on. But what I want you guys to really um to do right now, because I'm going to drop the link in the um description box. Mims, my good friend Mims, make it make sense. He's having a Real Housewives of it, not Atlanta, Real Housewives of um, Potomac live panel, and it's going to have Mims, Rodney the Voice, Jamie, that's me, and Gabor. It's going to be on um, Mims's page, and it will be airing at two thirty-five p.m. Eastern time. Okay, so make sure you guys tune into that. I am ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready, honey. I am ready. So I'm going to um. Well, I don't really have to put it in the description box. I already shared it on my community wall. So make sure you guys go over there, set your reminders, because I just said mine, because I want to see this panel, okay? Period. So with that being said, that's pretty much all that we got right now. Be sure to like, rate, comment, subscribe, share this video. Also, be sure to... Um, Make sure you click on the notification bell so you can be notified whenever a video drops. If you want to follow me on any form of social media, my Twitter, my Instagram, and my TikTok will be down below in the description box. With that being said, you guys, your boys up out of here until my next video. I will talk to you guys later. Rest in peace, Danita, and I will holler at y'all soon. Bye. What's up, guys? It's your boy, Tramel. I just wanted to say that I have a new project that's out. It's called mixed feelings it's on all streaming platforms i would hope that you would go and check it out it's a really good feel of an album it's got everything you need and more it's got r b it's got a little bit of pop it's got a little bit of hip-hop it's everything that you need and more it's out 
all streaming platforms, like I said. Please check me out. And you can also follow me at I am underscore Tramel. That's I am underscore T-R-A-M-E-L. Check me out. I hope to hear from you.